What is up, everybody? Uh, so I'm back. I got uh, 25 cards uh, back from PSA. Uh, mostly a blind reveal. I think I looked at a couple of the cards, the grades of the cards. Um, but for the most part, a, a blind reveal. And, uh, you know, <laughs> these are all modern. This is 1980 to present. I also have an order with PSA that is 50 vintage cards. I can't wait to get that, that back because it's like all vintage cards from my first personal collection. So I'm super excited to uh, get that back. Um, all right, so let's get uh, started. And uh, we're going to start off with a Jackson Churio. He's one of the top prospects for the Brewers. Uh, this is the first edition. And very nice. Good start. PSA 10 on the Jackson Churio. So... And it's a, it's the, you know, the first, first edition, um, just the paper, <laughs> um, Tanner Scoble, uh, auto and nice, another 10. So, uh, two for two on the, the tens. There was a point when, you know, you'd get like a, a, at the height of COVID where it was like, I was getting 25% PSA tens. <laughs> I feel like that they've gotten a little bit easier with the PSA tens lately, um, on modern cards especially. Uh, so here we go. Drew Jones. I got two of them. Two Drew Jones uh, Mega Box. Um, pretty much all these cards, by the way, uh, you know, pulled from, you know, packs of boxes that I've opened. I One of my goals is to really <laughs> uh, limit the amount of, car, you know, cards I get out of packs because it's just, you know, between the amount that you pay for the packs and uh, getting it graded, it's just not worth it. But anyway, uh all right, so we got a nice, a 9 and a 10. So I guess that's what you'd expect, uh, the 9 and the 10. <laughs> the funny thing is this one looks like it's better centered than this one. And yet this one got a 10 and this one got a 9. Beautiful looking card. I've heard Drew Jones um, hasn't started off, you know, his minor league career as awesome as maybe you had, you had hoped. Uh, but let's see here. Uh, yeah, Round one, second overall in 2022. So one of the big hits of Bowman Chrome this year. Uh, next up, uh, the uh, this is a, a thick card, L.A. De La Cruz. I submitted this when L.A. was doing incredible things. Uh, he's definitely cooled off since then. And uh, got a PSA 8. Um, these thick cards are super tough to get a high grade on. Uh, but it was one of those cards, like I, I, I was trying to get to 25 <laughs> and, uh, you know, Ellie was just going nuts. So I figured I'd submit this. Um, but PSA eight, you want to get at least a nine or a 10 on modern cards. So that one's a little disappointing. Um, all right. So let's get to the next group of cards here. I'm trying not to reveal what I got. Um, all right. Uh, next up is, uh, Justin, Justin Crawford and he is, I think Carl Crawford's son and 17th overall round one, 2022 and nice. Got a PSA 10, the, the lunar glow. That's a beautiful card. PSA 10 on the, uh, Justin Crawford. Uh, next up is in Otani and Ari Hara <laughs> Sapphire and oh, nice. Another 10 on the Otani. What is his name? Ari Hara, uh, PSA 10 Sapphire. Very cool. All right. Uh, another Otani uh, submitted this, you know, before he got hurt, of course. Uh, his cards at one point were going absolutely crazy, um, but they've come down a lot since then, since his injury. Um, so let's see what we got. A PSA 10. Very nice. All right. Next up, a another Jackson Churio first and another PSA 10. I've got three of these. I might, I might submit the third one. I, I just went with two just randomly. I tried to pick the best ones, but they all looked exactly the same. So, um, Noel V Marte, uh, he is one of the top prospects, number four prospect in his international signing. I know he's one of the top prospects in, in baseball and, uh, I, ugh, PSA eight on the uh, Marte number to 499. So not sure what happened there. Might have to take a closer look at that one. Um, all right, Matt Olson, and uh, I think this is an auto. Um, Matt Olson's having an incredible year. He's leading the all of baseball in home runs, 
And, oh, <laughs> PSA 8. Two PSA 8s in a row. Marte and Olsen. This is a nice card, too, at number 49. Uh, Panini done. This is, I, I had a feeling this might be tough to get a good grade on, you know, with the uh, the foil. Uh, so, and that, you know, 2017, so it's a little bit older than, you know, some of my, some of the other cards I'm submitting here. Um, all right, next up is uh, Derek Jeter Sapphire, and very nice, got a PSA 10 on that. Uh, somebody gave me this at the National a couple years ago, and I loved this card. I was like so excited when I got it. I just figured I'd get it slab so happy to get a PSA 10 there Andy Rodriguez uh, one of the prospects for the Mets I think I don't know if he's still with the Mets um, but nice a PSA 10 on the Andy Rodriguez Bowman Chrome Auto um, Otani uh, so this is like the platinum edition again this is when I submitted this when Otani's cards were going nuts uh, this one was definitely off center so I'm kind of hoping for a PSA 9 here and, oh man, that is awesome. PSA 10 on the Otani. Um, I don't know. I thought this was a little off, um, but I guess not. PSA 10 on that. Uh, I thought it was off left to right there. Um, I still think it's off, but I'll take it. PSA 10. Uh, next up, oh, is the big one. This uh, this might be one of the biggest cards. Like it, it, None of these are huge. Um, I was doing that, that vintage submission, and I wanted to get 25 modern out there. Um, so... This might be <laughs> one of the bigger cards that I submitted. It's the Purple Refractor. I think I got it out of the Rookie Explosion box. Come on, baby. Yes! <laughs> nice! So that is awesome. A PSA 10 on the Juan Soto. Wow. Very cool. And yeah, that you know this one, again, I thought was off top to bottom. Um, otherwise, it looked pretty much perfect. So... Pretty nice. I'm getting a lot of 10s. I don't know what the percentage is, uh, but this seems like it's going pretty well. Um, How You Lee. Uh, this is like a blue auto. Uh, all right. So, um, oh yeah, Mega Box Blue Refractor of How You Lee. So PSA 9 on that. So like I said, you know, when you get a 9 or a 10 on these cards, um, after getting a 10 on the Juan Soto, um, that was probably the card I wanted to get a 10 on. More than anything, so I'm, I'm happy regardless. Uh, Jonathan Clace, I think he's one of the top prospects for the Mariners. Uh, nice, and there's the Sapphire in a PSA 10. Again, you know, it's not like it's a parallel or anything, but um, still always good to get a get a 10. Uh, Corbin Carroll, uh, Mega Box, uh, got a PSA 9 on that, so not bad. Um, Another L.A. De La Cruz. Um, I forget what this is, like a shadow box or something like that. So let's see what we got. Ooh, a PSA 6. So on every single, it's amazing, on every single PSA order, there's always one. There's always one card that you just scratch your head and you're like, what, like, where did you get a PSA 6 on that? I, I Again, I'll have to take a closer look. You know, it's got that, you know, it's a, you know, dark color, so... The, you know, there's the, the black borders there, which always make it tougher, but it look, looks pretty good to me. Um, so, yeah, I don't know. Got a, got a six on that one. All right, so we got about five cards left. Uh, Corbin Carroll paper, uh, Bowman first, PSA 9. Not bad. I'll take it. PSA 9. Uh, Adolis Garcia. This is the Sapphire rookie that's been sitting in my... Uh, uh, just sitting there for a while, been one of those cards that's like on the cusp of sub submitting, but he's having another really nice year, quietly having a very nice year. He's uh, doing great for my, great things for my fantasy team uh, on the Rangers. And very nice, a PSA 10 um, rookie, uh, Adolis Garcia Sapphire, 2019. I remember that box, that was a hell of a box. I think I got like, I think I hit this, I hit a judge, I think I hit a... Um, that was the year, I, I think that was that box that I hit the Eloy Jimenez, number to 10. Um, all right, we got about four left, and let's see what we have here. Acuna, <laughs> some of these cards are like, why did I, why would anybody submit this? It's like a Panini, I just thought it looked, it was cool looking, so nice, PSA 10. I uh, just thought, look at this card, it's beautiful. Teal Wave Prism, PSA 10, Ronald Acuna, who's having <laughs> a season for the ages, uh, congrats to, uh, man, the Braves are just loaded. Um, 
But uh, I think Acuna is, what, like the fifth guy to hit 40-40? Um, I think he's like 40-60. Uh, having an incredible year. MVP season. Uh, he will win the MVP. Uh, Acuna and Otani. Uh, Otani, I think, you know, will still win the uh, um, the MVP. So here, there you go. PS Two PSA 10s of the, the two uh, MVPs this year. Acuna and Otani. <laughs> Very cool. Future stars. Then we got two more. Uh, an Otani and a Gabriel Gonzalez. <laughs> so Shohei Otani, uh, PSA nine. Um, love, I really like this card because they, you know, the, uh, you know, as a, uh, Mattingly fan love 84 tops. So it's a throwback to 1984 tops. Uh, but unfortunately came back as a nine. And then the final card of the order, Gabriel Gonzalez, Sapphire, and another PSA 10. So <laughs> that's that's great. Uh, again, I thought this was off center. I wouldn't have given it a 10. I would have given it a 9. Um, but I know PSA, they're they're very lenient with the centering. Um, I I think this is off left to right, but I'll take <laughs> that's I'll take the PSA 10. So and another uh, great prospect, um, you know, one of the better prospects in baseball. So uh, at least that, that came out of 2023 Bowman Sapphire. So there you have it, guys. Uh, another PSA order. Uh, still waiting for the 50 vintage cards. Um, and I just actually sent another 30-plus cards <laughs> off to uh, PSA, including a, uh, a Vlad Refractor and a bunch of other cards that it'll take months before I get back. So, But when I do, I'll, I'll post a video. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Um, you know, some cards that probably didn't deserve to get, you know, spend uh, almost $20 on grading, but I have fun with it. That's really all that matters. And uh, that's it. Uh, thanks. Thanks for watching, guys. And I will talk to you later. Peace.